If y'all like the pranks and I like doing the pranks, why am I doing the pranks? If y'all like the vlogs and I like to vlog, why am I vlogging? If y'all like the story times and I like giving the story times, then why the fuck are we not fucking Dr. Susan? What's up YouTube? It's your boo, it's your girl, it's me! And I'm back with another mother flipping video. And I know that I've been MIA and I know that I haven't been here and I know that I just wanna just, all right. My camera's auto-focusing and it's doing whatever it wants. But I just want to talk to y'all real quick on like a real to real one on one basis. It's 5 o'clock in the morning and I'm recording this because I have literally been off of YouTube for like three months. I'm going to tell y'all everything that's been going on, the reason why I've been off of YouTube, what I've been doing, where I've been at, who I've been with, how I've been doing and everything like that. But first off, I want to give a big shout out to Cheyenne. I didn't, unfortunately I did not get her at name or anything like that, but um i was coming home from work and i was going into wawa because i was kind of hungry and the young lady who was making my food actually noticed me from my channel and she was like joy you know basically like what's up where you been what you been doing i've been waiting for another video and i've been neglecting youtube like i've been neglecting youtube i've been neglecting y'all and it's not even for no other reason besides of myself. And I'm gonna talk about that in this video and just talk about like some things that I've been going through and things like that. But I will say that that was definitely motivation for me to come here today, for me to come to y'all today and come back, come back to this. Shout out to you Cheyenne for um, staying a faithful subscriber and I thank you so much and I thank all of y'all for who have you know been faithful subscribers on my new subscribers that i've gained um and just being here with me through this journey so if you are not subscribed you already know what i'm about to say hit that subscribe button don't forget to like and thumbs up this video don't forget to tell a friend and tell a friend and tell a friend and tell a mother freaking friend to follow dress to the world on youtube and let's get into this video because i'm only going to be real with y'all because y'all be real with me you feel me so the real deal this is the real deal during the time that I stopped recording, um, multiple things were going on. One, I was losing my accessibility to edit videos. Um, the iPad that I was using to edit videos got taken away. Um, and also, the my backup plan to the iPad, which is the MacBook that I use in my building, became unaccessible to me to use through iMovie. So while I'm recording this, I don't even know how I'm gonna edit this video, but I'm recording it and I'm gonna edit it and I'm gonna get it to y'all in some type of way. If I gotta record it on, I mean, edit it on my phone, that's just what's gonna have, have to happen. So that was like one of the things that kind of like took me back from, cause I was like, how I'm gonna record videos and I don't even have a way to edit videos. But um, that shouldn't have been something to stop me, but it did. I'm a procrastinator, I'm a, you know, person that makes up excuses. Oh, this not working, so that's what it is. And, that's what, and I'm working on that. Another thing was, I, I'm also, if you guys do not know what you guys should know, because you guys should follow me on my SoundCloud, which is listed below in the description bar, like I always list below. Follow me on my social media platforms, Instagram, Facebook. No, I don't have Facebook. Sorry, Instagram, Snapchat, and SoundCloud. Um, that is listed down below. I do music that is my main goal here i said it before i'm saying it again i'm a rapper that is where i ultimately would like to be in life i would like to not be a bartender for the rest of my life i would like to rap and perform and bring music to you guys that you guys fuck with excuse my french but that is what it is and so um i'm also in the where it was in the process of like finding management which that is like the hardest part for me because for one 
it's hard to find a manager that you can trust in that knows where you're trying to go in the industry that doesn't want to just use you it's, it's really it's a lot of things that goes into finding the proper management team and so i can speak on this i guess i am in a contract until august which is next month i signed a contract with the management that was like a two-year contract when i was in miami um that will be over next month and i will be free to do whatever the freak i want but in going through that management process and this is for everybody that's trying to be a model an actor a rapper a singer whatever you if you want to be in the entertainment business it's really hard finding management if i could if my my dreams could come true and in my perfect little world i would have my mom be my manager because i feel like my mom is my best friend She's my mother and she's not going to screw me over at the end of the day. And if she is going to screw me over, that money that she's screwing me over to get is going to come back to me regardless. So that's why I would like for my mom to be my manager. But she got a lot of stuff, other stuff going on. So I try to self-manage. But it's hard, you know, doing the business aspect, the social media. I suck at social media. I'm working on that as well. Um... You know, just the whole meeting and greeting of people, the socialization, all of that is like, it's a lot to go into that. I feel like I'm the talent. I just need to show up, perform. One of the people who were, uh, you know, into that category of about to manage me actually told me that um, YouTube was not really the best look for me and my career. Sometimes, I guess when i do like pranks or like funnier videos that may be spoofy or something like that which realistically those get the most hits like my pranks my prank videos and my spoofy videos and stuff like that are the highest ranked videos on my channel um i think i'm a pretty motherfucking funny person you know i feel like i'm kind of got a little slight comedian in me i know that at the end of the day i gotta do me i gotta do joy and i got to do what i know works for joy so if y'all like the pranks and i like doing the pranks why i'm not doing the pranks if y'all like the vlogs and i like to vlog why i'm not vlogging if y'all like the story times and i like giving the story times then why the fuck are we not fucking dr susan you feel me so i just feel like right now I gotta go my own path, my own direction, do what works for me, and hopefully everything that I want, business-wise, career-wise, music-wise, will follow. I was also, you know, like trying to just focus on one thing. It's kind of hard for me to do that sometimes. It's kind of hard for me to, you know, tackle multiple things like that at once, but that's life. So at the end of the day, that's what I got to do. No matter how much I want to sleep. No matter how much I feel like it's taking a strain on me. No matter how much I feel like it's a struggle. That's what I got to do if I want to be successful. And I'm so happy that I'm talking to y'all. Because like seriously y'all are my outlet. Like I don't be having to talk. I be rambling to myself about this type of stuff. And my earring keep falling off. It don't want to stay on so it's going to go off. But I be rambling to myself about these type things. Like. You know, like, oh, maybe I should just do this, or maybe I can't do this, or maybe this is too much, and I know I should get up, but da 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 da. But no, seriously, this is this is really what it is, and we here with it. Like, I feel like y'all get me, I get y'all, and I can be myself with y'all. Um, to my single frauding, um, which is dropping in like two days, probably on SoundCloud and um Spotify, but the music video is out to that fraud and go check that out um, i did a shiggy challenge to end my feelings by drake and it went viral y'all it went viral i went viral i'm so happy i didn't know what to do i was like oh my god oh my god i went viral but yeah so check that out on my instagram my instagram will be listed below um i'm gonna take this other earring off because it just looks weird so that's pretty much what's been going on and now that with that being said um basically my channel is going to change a little bit so all of my subscribers that are here now i know you guys um are used to uh you know the vlogs and the pranks and the story time and stuff like that all of that will still be here all that will still be here i'm still going to be doing pranks 
I'm still going to be doing vlogs. I'm still going to be doing story times. I got a new job. So I'm definitely going to bring that into, you know, the channel. However, it's going to be more, um, you're going to see a lot more of my journey with the music. So, um, it's going to be a lot more studio session um, vlogs. A lot more personal vlogs of the things that I deal with when I'm dealing with people in the industry. It's going to be um, things that I deal with on a daily basis as just being a up and coming underground artist trying to make it in the industry, the profession, into the professional industry, the big leagues or whatever you want to call it. It's going to be a lot of that. Sometimes I might have little breakdowns that I just record of, you know, how I'm feeling because. I, I be feeling defeated. I be feeling like I'm going to give up. I be feeling like it's pointless. I be feeling like I ain't good enough. I be feeling like a lot. But, you know, I pray and I just stay motivated. And I know that what I was put on this earth to do. And it is nothing more, nothing less than to entertain. So that's what keeps me going. But, yeah, so that's like going to be a little just transition. So if y'all see studio session vlog, click that shit. Because it's going to be lit. I know it ain't going to be the norm of what type of vlogs y'all looking forward to. But it's me. Like, it's going to be entertaining regardless. It's going to be lit regardless. If y'all see the day in the life of, click that shit. Because it's going to be lit regardless. It's going to be me regardless. I'm entertaining regardless. So, even though it may not be your niche or your, your thing that you want to do, it's all going to, like come together as one so even if it's i'm vlogging and i'm with my friends and we going out to eat and i do a prank that's going to be on the same level as if i'm in the studio or talking to somebody about a video it's going to all be like the same type of energy i'm giving y'all the same type of vibe i'm giving y'all just different settings and i just want to bring y'all on this journey with me and i know i'm rambling on and i'm about to cut it short but i just want to bring y'all on this journey with me to you know making it because I'm going to make it, God willing. And, um, yeah. And I will, I'm not going to say that I would never because I don't know what could happen. Or I don't want to make any empty promises. But I'm going to try my hardest not to abandon you guys or myself like that again. Because three months, I, I was doing YouTube for... Before I stopped, I was doing YouTube for three months. Like three or, yeah, like almost three, almost four months. And I was on a consistent, you know, build. I just, I just started getting my, into the rhythm of YouTube. And then I just went MIA. And that ain't cool. And, but I'm back. I'm here. I'm back and I'm better. I'm lit. Shout out again to you, Cheyenne, because you were my motivation to record this video at five o'clock in the morning because just knowing, just knowing that you was, you was waiting. And it's here, baby. It's here. So, yes. It's Joy to the World. Subscribe, like, comment, share. All that shit. Tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend to follow me on YouTube at Joy to the World. Check out my frauding video that is below this video. It's popping. It's lit. It's directed by Gene Visual. Shout out to you. He's popping. If you're in the Philly area and you need a video shot, Philly, Delaware, and Jersey because he's all over the place. Um, I'll put his information below as well. And yeah, y'all, that's just it. I'm going to now try and figure out how I'm about to edit this video and upload this video because I don't have any editing device, but I'm going to do it. And I think that that's all I have to say. I'm going to take my ass to sleep and I'm going to edit this in the morning. And yeah, stay black, stay blessed, stay beautiful.